So the, the sequelizer is a device that fishermen use to ensure the survival of fish that you have to release. So if they're undersized or out of season or just generally not your target species and they're also bottom dwelling fish so they have a swim bladder in them, when you catch them they're often bloated and the added buoyancy that the inflation or the expansion of the gases inside their body cavity um, typically prevents them from being able to swim back down. They can't overcome the added buoyancy and the stress that the fish is under has a lot to do with it as well. The sequelizer is a device that you can snap onto the fish's lip, hook the device and the fish onto a weighted fishing line, and then the lead or the weight overcomes the added buoyancy of the fish, dragging it back down, and at the depth that you set the device to, it automatically triggers and lets the fish go in its natural habitat where the gas inside of him has sufficiently recompressed. He's no longer as buoyant as he was at the surface. The stress on the fish has been relieved and their odds of survival are much higher. And barotrauma has been an issue that we've all been exposed to. No one likes to see the fish floating behind the boat after you catch them. Um, Puncturing the internal organs with a hypodermic needle never seemed like a really great idea, but there wasn't much else out there in terms of a solution to the problem. We realized that a non-invasive solution to the barotrauma issue was going to be uh, more conducive to their survival. And being sustainably minded, um, it was just a natural uh, progression for us. The scale has increased dramatically since when we started in the garage at, my, at our parents house you know uh, we were making dozens of devices at a time selling them onesie twosies to individuals and a couple of shops and uh, now at least through the return right program we've distributed almost 30,000 units to fish anglers in the gulf of mexico so i think it's it's really done a lot of great work so it's been a well adopted So growing up, our father taught us uh, about the cycle of a sportsman. Um, and the idea was, you know, when you start off, you want to go catch a fish. And then after you catch a fish, you want to catch as many fish as possible. And then after you catch as many fish as possible, you want to catch the biggest fish, you know, a trophy fish. And then once you've kind of uh, done all three of those, the next thing that comes up is, how can you help protect these fish? And you've already got to enjoy all the other aspects. So learning the conservation side is just the final progression of the sportsman cycle and it's kind of where we've fallen into after our lives at sea. So a really meaningful interaction that I had with a charter captain was when he told me that he will take a group out and he'll have half the anglers that have chartered him catching fish and the other half he'll put on releasing fish and the ones that are releasing fish are having just as much fun letting them go as the ones that are catching them. So that was a really uh, great moment for me.